Gut Feeling by Lily Gray Rudge. Music and lyrics by Emily Salatan. Directed by Sage Overbay. Music directed by Henry Roseman. And stage managed by Molly Brislin. Camille, a 17-year-old struggling with ulcerative colitis who in the process of having his colon removed learns to stand up for himself and his health. Camille's colon, a dreamed up manifestation of Camille's anxiety, desperate to seduce Camille into keeping him, even if it is detrimental to their well-being. Doctor, a goofy and slightly unprofessional surgeon doing their best to lift Camille's spirits. Nurse, a strict and by the book surgical assistant who serves as the doctor's right hand man. The bathroom is a universal experience, right? Well, not for me. Instead, I'm one of the very lucky. 1.5 million with an inflammatory bowel disease. not trying to break anything. The ensemble brandishes their surgical tools at Camille. Watch where you point those things. You aren't using those on me, right? You know what? We should reschedule. Whoa. Sorry. Where are you going? Home. Hardly. You have a collective. No, I don't want anyone to dissect me. Slow down. Let's take a sec to review. Even if you say you're fine, your colon's trying to kill you. No, I actually just changed my mind. Camille, let me continue. You were diagnosed at 12 years old with ulcerative colitis, so it all began five years ago. Don't deny it, you can't write it off the charts. Gender male, age 17, non-smoker, border, underweight, inflammatory, bowel disease, and vaccinations up to date, plus possible mortality, blood clots, damage, side effects, forgive my bleak mentality, you can't promise I'll be better off the charts. I can deal, I've made it this far. In pain, that's insane, it'll only get harder. Hell, you can tell from your medical chart you need this. Slicing me open, really the only option? Well, we can put you back on medication, but frankly, we risk the same side effects. This is a chance to... To reenact, psycho! You don't have to spend your life locked inside a bathroom stall in infections and inspections. You're right, it's not sustainable. I know why I'm here today, so cut me open, get it out. It's the price I have to pay to be better. Be I'll be off the charts. Good afternoon, Camille. Hey, Dr. John. Is this stool taken? <laughs> <laughs> Now, I know you're a little nervous, but try not to worry. This colectomy is a clear step towards managing your ulcerative colitis. Ulcerative colitis, when your white blood cells attack you, your body takes a hit. Your colon fills with ulcers as they argue and commit. You spend life on the toilet because you really have to. That's ulcerative colitis. Exactly. Many people live fulfilling lives without their colon. I know this disease must really stink. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just ask your urgent and bloody diarrhea. <laughs> uh, tough crowd. They do say laughter is the best medicine. <laughs> Anyways, there's only a 0.9% chance of death as long as we avoid infections, reactions, blood clots, etc. Or, of course, if my hand slips. <laughs> right. Uh, okay, Camille. Count them from 10 for us. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Going under. Scalpel, Scalpel scissors, scissors, clamp, tweezers, tweezers, forceps, 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 forceps,
Your? Your? Your intestine. Your large intestine. Your colon. You're larger than I thought you would be. I get that a lot. Am I dead? <laughs> dead. That's rich. Coming from Are someone you who's- God? Please. Do I look like Morgan Freeman to you? Oh no, I'm just teasing. I know I'm much more handsome. So, Camille, why exactly am I packing my bags? Where are we headed? Australia? I did hear someone say we're going under. <laughs> I'm not headed anywhere, but... Congratulations! You are the winner of a one-way ticket to a bucket marked biohazardous waste. Departure time now. Mm, not your best joke, but I am a hard act to follow. No, I'm serious. I think it's time for you to go. Pardon? I don't go anywhere without you, dear. We go together like white blood cells and plasma. Oh, what would you even do without me? Go to all of my classes, hang out with my friends, maybe even have a real relationship. The list goes on. <laughs> Whoa. Do not blame me for your shitty date. Really? Are we resorting to potty language? What? You don't like a little dirty talk? Hit it! I need your body. I can't go alone. It's your calling, calling. So pick up the phone. Without you, I swear, would know what to do. Cause you're a part of me and I'm a part of you. Oh. Body. I can't go alone. It's your calling, calling. So pick up the phone. Come a little closer. We can get skin to skin. Which happens to be your and my body's largest organ. Oh, Body. I can't go alone It's your calling, calling So pick up the phone We can take it slow Like a kidney stone It's your calling, calling So pick up the phone Don't touch me a cloud of Camille's white blood cells, sensing danger, arrives on the scene, ready to beat up the colon. Is this guy bothering you? Yeah, actually. Get him, boys! We're white blood cells. If we think you're an imposter, it's time to intervene. Rip and at your insides like a finely tuned machine. And all because your tissue doesn't show the right proteins. White blood cells! Oh, oh, let me up, you pesky Leukocytes, let me up! He's going septic, give me antibiotics! We're antibiotics, when we hear there's an infection, we know what we must do. Defend our friends and family from this giant tube of poo. And no, we're not effective on this viruses or flu. Antibiotics! Ow! Ow! This is extremely unhelpful. Get off of me! Ow! Ow! You're hurting me! Stop! Well, Hi, y'all. Right, Remember, guys, you, barbecue on Thursday. Oh, thank you. My dashing hero. I'm not your hero. Look what happens when we're together. It's a nightmare for both of us. Both of us? I'm the one getting gut punched over here. If you really feel that way, then why not let those parasites finish me off? Or do you plan to do it yourself? Enough, I'm done. Done with your dirty work, done with it all. Wait, are you really breaking up with me? If you, you should go Pack up and get out And leave me alone Though I can't come to grips In my head that something 
I harbored inside me will be dead. But this was never healthy. This was never right. It's a gut feeling something's wrong. You clearly can't be what I need. It's cute that you think you can just up and leave. Cause now, ha, now after all I've been through, you can't break up with me because I break up with you. Yeah, you were never healthy. Wow, okay. You were never right. It's a gut feeling something's wrong. I really hate your guts. I won't be rejected. It's taught that I'm dumping you, but you just can't prevent it. How did you even turn this around? You need one last word when you're already down. I should have known you change horses mid-race. It's funny, I guess you'll sell honor to save face. You're toxic, you're caustic. I see why I got sick. Ironic. What? It's the end of something chronic. We'll never I I stayed you. with you. We'll never a be right. Gaslight is a god feeling. Something's wrong. I really hate your guts. I won't be rejected. It's tough. So let me get this straight. You are dumping me? Camille, I know it's hard to understand, but look what happens when we're together. It's a nightmare for both of us. Wow. I mean, if you really feel that way, I guess I have no choice. I have to let you go. Try not to take it too hard, sweetie. I'm just an independent biological structure. I can't be tied down. Well, you know what they say. If you love something, have it surgically removed. I'm so glad that we can both be mature about this. Suddenly, a large pair of tweezers appear lashing onto the colon. Hey! Watch the merchandise. Wait, hang on a second. Why are you pulling me? No, not the bucket! Camille! Say hello to my tonsils for me. Welcome back. How are you feeling? I was actually asking for a pain rating on the scale of 1 to 10. Oh. His symptoms soon will disappear and now it's up to you. As witness to the toxic shit this patient has been through. If nothing else, remember this, cause it's how we break the taboo. End of 
of play.